Hmm. It took him two weeks at max. <laughs> I still won't go home. Father, apologizing to me? That never happens. It's as rare as the planetary alignments of the Moon, Mars, Mercury, Venus, Jupiter, and Saturn. You've been shouting the word what at an alarming amount of times lately. And why are you the one panicking? <laughs> Your parents are letting him in. Now, how many watts were that already? One, two, three, four. I'll keep count, don't worry. What? <laughs> oh, he went inside. Go on, then. Are you planning on staying here? Well, I'm gonna go take a shower. Oh my god, Miss Pretty Delinquent. Your throat is going to give up on you if you keep shouting like that so early in the morning. Entertain my father for me, will you? That's the fifth time now. You said you'll help me, right? Then good luck. <laughs> Why are you just standing there? What? Oh. Oh. What's wrong with you? <laughs> You're like this because I'm only wearing this towel around me? Mm -hmm. Are you that flustered after seeing my body? Despite me staying here for two weeks already, this is actually the first time you've seen me like this, right? <laughs> all right, all right. I'll go wear some clothes now. <laughs> How adorable. <laughs> I'm fully clothed now, miss. Pretty delinquent. So, what did you hear? <laughs> Laughter. Father? Laughing. That's unusual. I'm going downstairs. Oh. Oh. Vera, father. Vera, will you please come home with me? I'm not going home with you. I refuse to go back. Vera! Ma'am, with all due respect, are you perhaps trying to make my father apologize? <laughs> That's an impossible feat. I do appreciate the thought, though. Vera, I already told you. I'm happier here than I ever was at home. She... She makes me happy. And I won't let you make me distance myself from her either. If you do that, I really will not appear in front of you ever again. I'm sorry. Huh? Are you... apologizing? I'm sorry for never taking your feelings into consideration. I'm sorry for being a bad father to you. I thought what I was doing was for the best, but I never thought of your feelings at all. I didn't know that I was already hurting your feelings and pushing your ideals so forcefully. You... So please come back. I... I won't tell you to distance yourself from her either. I trust her. You... Wait, you trust her? Yes. Her parents were my classmates during high school. We were close friends. They also told me off earlier when I came in. I... I thought... Let's have a talk later. Please. We'll hear you out now this time, so please come home. I... Vera... <laughs> I'm really... Sorry. I, I only ever wanted you to be proud of me. To, I know. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry for not realizing sooner. <laughs> I, I, I miss I'm this. sorry, Vera. I miss this so much. <laughs> I, I love you. Dad. 
I love you too. Fair. I'm sorry. <clears throat> give me a call if you're ready to go home, okay, Vera? Yeah. I'll give you a call later once I get my stuff ready, Dad. Okay. Oh, and miss... Thank you for being there for her. I hope you continue to take care of her in the future as well. Uh, Dad! I'll be going now. Oh, and it looks like I've actually seen you somewhere before, but I can't seem to- <clears throat> Just go already. <sighs> Alright. See you later, sweetheart. Bye. God, why does he have to be like that? Mm? Yes. That's thanks to you, though. Well, mostly your parents. <laughs> what are the odds of them being close during high school, though? It really is a small world. I'll be going home later. Oh, are you going to miss me, Rumi? <laughs> Thank you, though. Really. Anyway... I should go pack up now. Yes? What is it? Go on and tell me while I'm still here. Have we met before? <laughs> I don't know. Have we? <laughs> it's fine if you don't remember. Yes. We have indeed met before. Is this an interrogation? Are you the good cop or the bad cop? <laughs> we met once when we were kids. You probably don't remember though. <laughs> You're so persistent. You actually saved me before. Just like you have right now. So you technically saved me twice now. Thrice, actually, if you count the allergy incident. Oh my, you really are my knight in shining armor. <laughs> it was actually a similar situation as this, but a different reason. I also ran away from my parents that time, and while in the process, I went by a nearby river. I lost my balance and slipped into the water. I thought I was a goner. I regretted running away and wanted to escape because I couldn't breathe. That was when a kid my age dived in and got me out. Though I was unconscious back then when I got out of the water. And I woke up from you performing CPR on me. How'd a kid even know how to do CPR like that? Oh, sorry. But yes, you saved me back then. I still vividly recall that memory. I mean, you did CPR. You know what that is, right? Mouth to mouth. So yes, you did kiss me. You were my first kiss, basically. How romantic. <laughs> don't think too much of it. You don't even remember it, right? Oh, you thought I was a boy. <laughs> Oh, I do recall chopping my hair off in an attempt to rebel my parents at that time. <laughs> my apologies, I was having tantrums. Yes, what is it? Did I know you were the girl who saved me back then the whole time? <laughs> mm, who knows? It's not like I'm going to tell you now, am I? I'm not going to tell you. Ask me one more time, and I'll end up kissing you, Miss Pretty Delinquent. Stop asking the question. I really will do it, you know. Don't say I didn't warn you. Uh, 
Sorry, doing that to you was a tomb. I, <laughs> I should go and pack my things up now. My apologies for doing that to you. Please excuse me. <laughs> Thank you for allowing me to stay here with you, ma'am. I'm really grateful for your hospitality and kindness that you've given to me in the short period I stayed here. I'll never forget this. Thank you very much. Thank you as well, Miss Pretty Delinquent. You're such a wonderful friend to have. Well then, I'll be off. Thank you again. <laughs> The world was that. Oh, shit. Why is my heart still beating like crazy like this? She's not even here anymore. I, I don't. I don't know. What is this? I don't know what this is. Is this? No. That's impossible. So, why do you invite me for a sleepover all of a sudden? Also, where is Vera? Oh, did she leave already? Why do you look so red right now? Okay then, I'm all ears. Hmm, that's good to hear. That she is reconciled with her father. But that's not the only thing that happened, right? You're hiding something. Come on, spill it! Ah, oh, you kissed her. Wait, what? You? You kissed her. Not the other way around. She kissed you first? Okay, she kissed you first because she got pissed and apologized still. And then you kissed her back. Wait a minute. Do you? You don't know. Hey, 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 are you serious right now? Why does it have to be her? You're really messing me up here, you know? Seriously, you should make up your mind already. Before that... Actually, no. I shouldn't do it here. Hey, are you free tomorrow? Yeah, it's a Saturday, so let's go on a date tomorrow. Come on, you guys postponed earlier, didn't you? Please? No, you don't need to bring Vera. Can it just be the two of us? It's just... Huh? It's okay? Oh, th thank you. Alright then, do you still have your board games around here? <laughs> Let's play then. Loser gets to pay for everything tomorrow. And she takes the bait. <laughs> Don't regret that, okay? You better keep that promise. 